um, Congressman Paul because, you know, I'm, I'm really, really strongly pro-liberty. I think you should be allowed to do whatever you want as long as you're not bothering anybody. And, and second, you know, his policies haven't changed in 76 years. Is he 76 years old? You know, um, I just feel like that, that you, at least you, you, you know what you're getting with the guy. You know, you can't, you can't. You can't really go back and say, well, he's he, he flip-flopped on really anything, or he's he said one thing and took one position and voted another way. So I just feel like, I never thought I'd say this, but, you know, I guess I'm a libertarian or something, you know? Thank you, sir. Teresa is one of the... Uh few people here actually from Iowa. A lot of folks in attendance are being bussed in. Participants are watching the process from different universities. But you're participating in the caucuses tomorrow night. First of all, your last name is? Urison. And what did you take away from today's event with Senator? What did you take away from today's event with Congressman Paul? Oh, I just, his message is so right on. And I think we need a leader like him because, in my opinion, this country is going in the wrong direction. Can Ron Paul get the nomination? I would hope he would. The only way he will, though, is through getting the word out. And the media has not been a great help to him. Actually, most of my information I get from the Internet. And um, it, to me, the media, last week it was who? Newt Gingrich. And now this week it's all about Santorum. And I'm... I just do not agree with um, the fact that, um, oh, what am I trying to say, um, that the media just totally ignores him, and his message, though, is the only one that can even try to turn our country around.